up for sale now vehicle max a beautiful 2009 volkswagen jetta four door tdi that's a diesel model with only 42,000 miles leather interior navigation and it's in great shape it also has a four brand new bf goodrich tires alloy wheels rear lip spoiler and a number of other options that i'll get into in just a minute it has a clean title and a clean carfax you can view right now for free at our website vehiclemax.net we are located at 3200 northwest 37th street miami florida 33142 is their zip code open monday to friday from 9 a.m to 6 p.m saturdays 9 to 5 and we're always closed on sundays we have been in the car business since 1992 and have sold over 21,000 cars we are an accredited member of the Better Business Bureau with an A-plus rating. You can check that out for yourself at our website. Right on the home page is a clickable link to the Better Business Bureau site, which will take you right to our rating. If you have any questions, feel free to call me. My name is George. I can be reached at 305-218-5462. Rear lip spoiler, alloy wheels, four-wheel disc brakes, and again, four brand new BF Goodrich tires, diesel model with navigation and leather. I'm going to finish going around the vehicle so you can see that the car has no dents, no hail damage, no love bug damage, no major scratches or touch-ups of any kind. And we're going to go ahead and move in now to show you the interior. It has privacy tinted glass. The door panels are all charcoal with a great trimming. Of course, we got uh, power door locks, power windows, power mirrors, uh, power release trunk and gas lid door. Got a driver's seat power recliner. Before I sit down, let me pan over the interior so you can see it's in great shape without any cuts, tears, or burn holes. Matter of fact, there's no burn holes anywhere in the seats, door panels, headliner, or carpeting, and there's no odor of smoke, so it looks like the previous owner may have been a non smoker. We got um, seat side airbags as well as curtain side airbags. Let me go ahead and get inside of it now, get it started for you. In the ignition, open and switch. The heater's already warmed up, and let's turn on. Let's get the AC going. Let's give the navigation a second to boot. Uh, all right, let's put down the front windows. I believe they're one touch, meaning you don't have to hold the switch for them to go down. Okay, and we're gonna go ahead and put this one down too. And as you can see, we have a touch screen. There we go. And there's your navigation. Car has 42,855 miles. Above the odometer reading, you can see the um, uh, you can see that it has uh, also an outside temperature reader. Automatic transmission with a manual shifting mode, and all that really means is um, it's automatic, but if you shift, by the way, they're all like this. Now we're, you, they're in reverse, neutral, and drive. And that's saying you're going to drive it 99% of the time. But if you want to make it shift manually, you can push the lever over to the right. And as you can see here, you can tap up or tap down to make it shift manually. So you would tap up to upshift and down to downshift. And if that doesn't interest you, just push the lever over and the automatic transmission will do the shifting for you. Got a cup, hold, uh, cup holders here in the center. Manual emergency brake. Okay. Um, get your main glove box over here. Got wheel locks and all. Let's go ahead and pan over the dashboard now so you can see it's in great shape without any cuts, tears, or burn holes, cracks. It's not lifting up anywhere. Pan over the passenger seating area now so you can see it's in perfect shape. Again, no cuts, no tears, no burn holes. Up in the top here, we have a little storage here for sunglasses. And you get map lights on either side here. Uh, you also get controls for the stereo right uh, here's uh, this is for to raise the volume here and to lower the volume over there. 
Okay, uh, let's go ahead and uh, move on to the passenger section of the vehicle. Gonna go ahead and turn off the car. Let's go ahead and listen to the radio. Alright. And let's go ahead and um, turn it off here. By the way, these controls here on the left hand side of the steering wheel, they're for the factory radio, so they don't work on this particular radio here. Uh, this is an aftermarket Pioneer navigation radio. So uh, and you get cruise control on this side, and you can control all your personal settings here and over here. Um, you also get heated seats. Raise a little wheel up and down to make your seat warmer. And the same thing on the passenger side. Okay, let's move on to the uh, passenger section of the vehicle in the back. This is a five passenger. Uh, two in the front and three in the back. Back in the back here we got anchors for your baby car seats. In case you do need one, you have anchors two on each side. In the back of the center console, you have AC vents for the railroad passengers. And you get these molded, uh, nice rubber heavy-duty floor mats that will collect the dirt for you and then keep your interior nice and clean. The rear door panels are the same as in the front. Uh, they're all charcoal black with a gray trimming. This vehicle does have the uh, child lock protection. I'll show you how it works. Stick your key in here or a screwdriver. Give it a half a twist to the left. And what that does is that disables this inside door handle. That's in case you got little ones and you don't want to be able to open the door from the inside. Once you engage that, the only handle that's going to open the door is the outer handle. To re-engage, just do the opposite. Get your key, put it in there, give it a half a twist back the other way, and uh, uh, this handle will start working again. Let's move on to the um, trunk area. By the way, all the tail lights and headlights are in perfect shape. They're not damaged or scuffed in any way. They're nice and clear. Go ahead and pop. Let's go ahead and pop the trunk here. Ah, let me do it from the inside here. It's got a release over here. Okay. All right. You get a nice, spacious trunk. It's very, very large for a for a compact car. Uh, great shape. No burn holes. No uh, no cuts. No tears. No um. No discoloration, no uh, bleach bar, no no bleach marks, no paint marks. Come around to the passenger rear here. Right rear door panel, perfect shape. I'm sure by now you noticed that none of the panels are damaged or cracked or cut. None of the speaker covers are damaged. The interior is in really really nice shape. By the way, you can fold these seats down by pulling on here, and you can access the. Uh, cargo area from the inside. If you don't have a middle row passenger, this will pop out into like a um, armrest and also has a little storage down there. Okay, let me give you a look at the headliner from a different angle here so you can see it's in great shape without any cut, tears, burn holes, or stains. All right, let's go ahead and open the last front door panel, the right front door panel. Right front door panel, perfect shape. Got a power recliner on the driver's side as well. Again, as I was telling you before, you got curtain side airbags and seat side airbags, as well as the two front uh, airbags. I want to talk to you about financing for just a second. If you require financing, let me tell you, we have excellent rates for good credit. We also have special financing for not such good credit. We even have some programs for really rough credit. If you're concerned about the financing, or you live a long distance away and you want us to go ahead and get you pre-approved, just go to the website, vehiclemax.net. Right on the home page, you see a silver tab that says apply for credit. Click it, fill it out completely. Click submit at the bottom of the page and then give us a call so we can retrieve your application and get you pre-approved. That's going to do it for the video in this unit. I want to thank you for watching our video at vehiclemax.net.